Uh, I mean, you know, much is, uh, much, not much has been said. Uh, you know, I think obviously we all know um, that uh, you know that game we just put out there, um, you know, wasn't wasn't what we need um, at this time of year, and um, especially uh, you know with the circumstances that we have on hand. So um, you know, I think everybody realizes that and um, knows that we have to be better. Tough from the start, Rado right here tonight. What did you see? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, I think they came out and, uh, and dictated the pace, and you know, I think uh, we gave um, gave them too much space to um, you know enter our zone, come through the neutral zone. I think um, you know early on they they used that uh, you know that uh, that four man attack uh, to their advantage, and uh, you know we weren't able to to maintain that. This was the first game back after a West Coast swing. What did you? What's your sense of the legs and the energy the guys had tonight? Um, I mean, it's uh, you know I think uh, you know we had had opportunity to rest out there, and um, you know for for us it's uh, you know at this time of the year it's uh, you know it's, it's 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 on us to make sure that we're um, you know no matter what whether your legs are into it. I think you know a lot of the things um, today. I don't think we're um, I think they were all, uh, you know, systems things that we didn't uh, we didn't handle properly and, and gave them the chances uh, and you know they were able to capitalize on them. Jeff, a lot of a lot of hockey left when it was four one. What do you think you guys weren't able to respond to that? Um, yeah, I mean, obviously, um, you know, going down four one is not not ideal, but uh, you know we had um, you know time to time to come back and push, and I thought you know at the end of the second period we, we um, you know we pushed. Uh, Push back a little bit, and you know it just that it wasn't enough at the end. And uh, you know I think you know right now it's uh, it's nobody's going to feel bad for us. Nobody's going to um, you know come in and magically find the answers. I think it's uh, you know within this these four walls. Um, you know I think everybody um, in here believes in the guy next to him, and um, you know it's uh, it's on us to to get. It. To get out of this as a as a as a group, and we've shown it before, and it's uh, it's on us to do it again. Jeff, you guys obviously know the mistakes of, of this trip and in these games. What do you think the issue has been with the starts in particular? Um, I don't know if there's there's one thing. I think uh, you know at, at times it looks like we're um, kind of seeing what the what kind of game the other team's going to bring, rather than um, you know I think when we're on and we're we're playing our game, we go out and dictate the pace. We keep it simple early and. Um, you know, we build our game from there, and um, you know, I think, you know, maybe a little bit on our heels uh, to start games. And um, you know, like I said, when we're we're on on our game, we're we're the team that's uh, you know keeping it simple early, making sure that we're getting um, you know getting pucks in, and and making sure that we're uh, you know we're on top of them and dictating the pace. It seems like you guys were doing more of that in Vegas. Why was it were you not able to translate any of that or carry any of that into tonight? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, I think we all looked at our, our game in Vegas, and you know there was some there were some breakdowns, there were some mistakes, but I think that was uh, you know the best best game we played in a while, and I think everybody felt good about that. And um, you know for whatever whatever reason tonight, uh, um, you know we weren't able to you know carry what we did in Vegas over to tonight. To go from that win streak to this losing streak now is it's almost like head scratching a little bit the way that things have. Whiplash to like that. Um, I mean, you know, there's things that we've we've identified that uh, that have slipped into our game and and things we need to improve on. And like I said, it's uh, you know we all believe in each other in here, and um, we believe that we have a have a group to uh, to come out of this and come out of this stronger. And uh, you know, I think it's going to take uh, um, you know a complete 60 minute effort here, um, and and. You know, continue to build off of those things. Razor, uh, Jeff was just talking about the belief that guys in this room have in one another. Can you just expand on that and how that can help you guys pull uh, yourselves out of the funk you're in? Um, yeah, you know, I think we we've had that belief all year, and um, we we do really trust each other in this locker room, and um, you know, confident that that will turn this around. Look, it's a little hard out from the outside understanding why these starts have been so bad with the. You know, you guys are running out of, out of games here. What, why do you think you guys haven't been able to show more? Um, you know, different things. I think it's it's for sure a mentality mentality thing, and I think we um, 
you know, if you look at if you look at the the three previous games, we we've had really tough starts, and that uh, you know kind of gets us ourselves in a hole to to kind of dig out. So um, that's a huge thing for us. We need to come out with better starts and um, keep us in it, and then you know just find a way to win hockey games. How do you find a way to find to get confidence in here when things have gone so badly for now six games? Um, you know, I think we we've shown to ourselves uh, in, in this room that, that when we play the way we're supposed to, we're a really good hockey team. Um, I think that's what what we need to remind ourselves of, and um, you know, just get back to the basics, start doing the the right things, and then good things will come out of that. So um, we we haven't lost the belief. We we know we're a good hockey team, so it's just about getting back to it. Because Dylan's obviously a big part of what you guys do, but how much of this stretch has been being without him, and how much is something else, many other other things, I guess. Um, obviously, a, a huge part of our team, our captain, you know, on and off the ice. Uh, but, but at the same time, we uh, we need to play better. I think that's just it. You know, we we know we can do it, um, and we play the way when we play the way we're supposed to. We're, we're a hell of a hockey team. So, um, obviously, a huge part for our team. But, but we need to get back to things here. Lucas, what do you think happened tonight? It doesn't seem like anything really clicked right from the start for you guys tonight. It's tough, you know, right after to, to kind of analyze it. But, you know, I think we just we just need to start off simple, you know, just just get to our ground game, get get pucks deep. Uh, cliches, really, but but that's what's been working for us. Get us deep, start skating, you know, getting pucks to the net and just play, play hard defensively. I think um, that's where we need to start. What you Awful start. Um, we had no legs. We had no pace. Uh, they were playing fast. I mean, we give them that easy offense early on, and then we just got rattled, got out of structure. Um, you know, just it piled up on the first period. Uh, didn't mind as the game went on. Um, unfortunately, the second period we were a little bit better, and they scored on probably three or four of the chances they had. Um, but again, the start. Got rattled with it, got out of structure, and it just piled on. So uh, disappointing because we showed some signs in Vegas, and uh, all we're going to concentrate on uh, in the next two days is our start at home on Thursday. Why do you think you guys weren't able to respond better at 4 one? Because you still have still a lot of hockey left. We did. I, I think we did actually. We had some looks. It's just that fifth goal buried us, and unfortunately, I believe it was the first chance of the period. We actually had some zone time at the end of the uh, uh, first. We had some zone time and looked at the beginning of the second, and then they got that fifth goal. And I think there was you know, obviously a little let down there. Uh, but again, I, the third period was a little bit better. But this this game was decided. Uh, in the first, we were slow. They were fast, uh, and then we got out of structure. You know, it was tough, tough watching some of those goals back. Just missed coverages, getting beat to the net. Um, so again, our concentration is going to be the start we have on Thursday. Derek, how much of this is on the goal tonight? No, 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 okay. no, 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 no. Uh, obviously, we probably with our six and zero, oh, six game winning streak and how good we were for a stretch there. Our goaltending was outstanding. Now, obviously, it's not outstanding, but this is not on the goaltending at all. We left the goalies out to dry. Poor Alex uh, in the first period um, didn't have much of a chance. I mean, your first look is Alex Tuck, Tuck coming 100 miles an hour down the middle of the ice. Like, that's on a soft play up the middle, you know, breakaway. Um, their team, if you give them easy offense, they're going to kill you. That's exactly what we did in the first period. Yeah, does this, does this go beyond just not having Dylan? Yes, it does. Obviously, there's some adjustment there. Dylan's a really good player for us. Just the way we're set up with, with not a ton of center depth, Dylan just slots everyone correctly. Uh, but our, our adjustment should be there. We showed uh, good hockey with, with a strong... Uh, outing against Vegas, a great third period. You know, lines were flowing and rolling. It, no, it's not. That's not done. It's one player. Uh, we have enough in that room uh, to be way better than this. Derek, it's hard to understand from the outside why there isn't more urgency because you guys are running out of. Are we running out? Yes. I mean, uh, luckily we've had some stretches in our season to keep us in this battle, but it's you're going to run out of time. Uh, again, our focus will be the first period on Thursday. Uh, so we'll talk about going in tomorrow. Um, that will be our focus going on Thursday and a good start at home on Thursday. Do you have any mentality thing? Then? I think a little mentality, 100%. It's just, again, this is a little frustrating in that I thought we had a little reset. I thought we had a little pushback with the group 
in Vegas. And then to start like we did tonight and just simply couldn't find our game throughout, um, not good. So it's, again, I think this group will respond with our start on Thursday. Valeno, is he? Valeno, I think it's more protocol. Obviously, I talked to him after. He seemed fine. Uh, but he'll, out, he'll see a doctor in the morning. Hopefully he'll be available for Thursday. On the ice, you talk about improving play off the ice. Both Petrie and Raymond talked about the belief that this group has in each yep. other. How big is that going to be for this group? Yeah, I, that doesn't surprise me. This, this group's responded pretty well uh, throughout. You know, this is a low low. Uh, so I, I think this group will respond well. Um, you know, just getting home is probably a little bit of a reset for us. Um, and then again, it's, it's that start on Thursday.